Right, welcome back to the channel. We are live here at the Cape Coast Sports Stadium. The Black Stars are in town. South Africa themselves have also landed. Today, we're going to hear from Coach Hugo Bruce about the game. He has revealed his strategy for South Africa ahead of that important clash on Sunday. We're going to talk about what Hugo Bruce said and what Milovan has been saying after that slip-up versus Ethiopia. He says... Uh, the focus now is on South Africa. That is sure to be quite a, a dicey one for the Black Stars. As usual, subscribe if you have not. Uh, click on the notification bell to get more updates. Uh, support the channel. Our merch link is in the description. Support the channel. Click on the merch and uh, gift someone a Sahara football merch. It goes a long way to help the channel very much to bring you more amazing content on this uh, amazing channel. Number one sports channel in Ghana. Let's get right into it. And we'll start off from the camp of Coach Milovan Rajabak. He has been speaking after the game versus Ethiopia, which Ghana slipped up. And Milo is of the opinion that the focus should now shift from uh, the Ethiopia slip up uh, to South Africa. He says uh, a win versus South Africa will ensure qualification to the playoff places at least. And Ghana, that is the aim now for the Black Stars here at the Cape Coast Sports Stadium, uh, where fans will be welcome. Uh, 5,000 is the number that we are looking at accommodating here at the Cape Coast Sports Stadium. And hopefully we can get that number. But Coach Milo has said that even if we had won Ethiopia today, uh, we would still need to beat South Africa on Sunday. And so uh, we have to give our best, gather the troops and give a good performance in the last match. For us, it is important to concentrate now for this match against South Africa and, give, and get what it takes to win. We had problems, especially in the defense. Uh, that's against Ethiopia. Uh, we made some mistakes. Everything will be decided on Sunday. The last match against South Africa is a crucial one. Uh, so we have to give our best to rally our troops and deliver a good performance and get this place in the playoffs and uh, coach hugo bruce has also been speaking the black stars players had a recovery training session this morning which we'll look at after this video about uh, hugo bruce has also spoken on his strategy for south africa heading into this final game the south african gaffer was speaking after his team won uh, one zero versus zimbabwe in that post match presser he initially did not know that his side needed uh, to win in order to qualify or needed to avoid a loss at least in order to qualify he thought that ghana needed three goals to win until he was corrected uh, but the south africa boss says his side is not coming to defend here in the crucial 2022 world cup qualifier game against ghana on sunday the bafana fana took a step closer to the next round of qualification after beating zimbabwe 1-0 at the fnb stadium on thursday night leaving hugo bruce three points clear of ghana at the top of group g south africa are set to face ghana in the deciding game this sunday at the Cape Coast stadium according to the coach bruce he will not line up with a defensive mindset but that his side will instead look to take the game to ghana we would make the biggest error or biggest mistake if we are going to defend on sunday when then you will see goals for sure you know one goal is nothing but the second goal, that is, uh, that then it becomes tricky, very tricky, the Belgian tactician said. Uh, we have to, in some periods of the game, we have to make a pain to Ghana also. If you are just defending, you lose the game, and let's hope that we don't lose the game with much goals. And that was before he knew that just a 1-0 loss marked the end of the journey for South Africa. But we will not do that. We have to also play our game. Okay, it's in Ghana. It's, it's different. Uh, but we will not only defend. Not at all. South Africa boss there clearly stating his game plan. It will not be to defend. They will bring the game to Ghana. And it will make for a thrilling encounter here at the Cape Coast Stadium. I'm looking forward to that game. Tomorrow's post-match presser will hear from the coaches and the players. who have their final training session tomorrow before the JAMA and everything. The boys are buoyant. Hopefully, they get the right things done this time. Uh, if that is what if, uh, what we saw against Ethiopia is what we'll see here at Cape Coast, uh, we might as well kiss the World Cup goodbye. But Hugo Bruce is not going to sit back, according to him. We'll see what happens on Sunday. We'll have a look at the training session, recovery training session that was had earlier today. Subscribe if you have not. Uh, don't forget to purchase our merch link 
is in the description. I'll see you guys in the next one. Let me know your thoughts in the comments box. Is Hugo Bruce right uh, to say that he will not be packing the bus? Let me know what you think. I'll see you guys in the next one. Enjoy your day.